Welcome to our Sims Free Play Advent Hint Tips and Tutorial. Every day on the one up to Christmas I'm going to be sharing with you a new hint or tip to help you play Sims Free Play better. Day 19 is all about teenagers. Now to have a teenager in your town you must have completed the teenagers quest. You can age up your preteens to a teenager by going onto a stove and baking a birthday cake. A birthday cake is 5 LPs and takes one day and once you've finished baking you can give that to your preteen and they will have a birthday and turn into a teenager. Once you have completed the life dreams and legacies quest your sims will automatically age. Your preteens will automatically turn into a teenager unless you pause their aging. Once you have a teenager you can of course use a wardrobe to change their clothes like you can with all the other sims. Teenagers do have a ton of awesome clothes. You may not have access to all of these clothes that you can see now. Some of them may have been unlocked with various different limited time events and quests. Your teens have the usual needs like all the other sims have. They have hunger, bladder, energy, hygiene, social and fun. And these can be filled in the usual way by eating food, going to the toilet, sleeping on a chair or bed, talking to other sims, taking a shower, bath and watching TV or various other things for the fun need. Your teen sims can also drive, they will need an adult for this. Once you can have cars in your game, you can click on a car with your teen and learn to drive for five hours. Like I say, you have to have an adult sim on the lot. You can see here the teen and the adult are coming out and they are going to take this car for a drive. I have done a whole separate video on driving but when your teen sims are out driving these musical notes appear and they give you either simoleons or sometimes LP depending upon the car so it's a good way to earn some extra simoleons or LP. Your teenage sims also do go to school like your pre-teens. The pre-teens go to Simtown Elementary, your teenagers will go to Simtown High. And you get them to go to school in the same way that you take adult sims to work. Go into the occupations tab and you need to enroll them in school. Here you go, you can enroll them there. And then you can just send them off to school the same way that you would send an adult sim to work. They have levels of school, so their grade average is a junior student. They are level 1 of 7. The more you send them to school, the higher their level will become and the more simoleons and XP they will earn when they're in school. You can improve their grade quicker in school by using a study desk. Your teens can take part in a ton of the hobbies. They can take part in arcade gamer, archery, bowling, breakdancing, broomstick flying, catwalk modelling, class clown, cooking, diving, dog agility, dog obedience, fashion hunter, figure skating, internet kitten, juggling, makeup artist, potion brewing, puppy pals, snorkeling, spellcasting, storytelling, surfing, survivalist and teen idol. So that is a lot of hobbies that your teens can do. One that is unique to the teen sims is the teen idol hobby. The teen idol hobby is used to unlock this Simtown sign. And when you have unlocked the Simtown sign to level three, you are able to build this teen idol mansion, which is special for your teen idol teenage sim. And it's a pretty nice build and it's a really, really nice lot actually. Take a look at the lot that it comes on. Your teens can also interact with any age sim, unlike the toddler and the preteen who can't interact with babies, your teenagers can interact with babies, which is nice. And that is all about your teenagers. If you have any other questions about teenagers, leave them down below in the comments and I will try my best to answer them. But thanks so much for watching, give the video a thumbs up, subscribe if you're new to the channel and I will see you tomorrow for another video. Thanks for watching, bye!